Good evening and welcome back once again. So today we're away to Espanyol. We had a 6-0 win in the last match. Martinelli getting a hat-trick. And the two matches before that, Castro got a hat-trick in each of the matches. So some brilliant displays all around. Now Ruben Castro is still on that flashing up, which means that his experience is higher. It's gaining improvements a lot more quickly. So we're going to play him in as many matches as we can while that's ongoing. A few changes. Uh, got Mudrick coming in on the left wing in place of Martinelli. We've got uh, Zirgoff coming in that left wing back position. Mandanda's going to stay in goal because she was on a bit of a down but other than that pretty much a full strength lineup and the next match we've got coming up after this is Barcelona and then we've got a Champions League the final group stage game against Milan we're actually two points ahead at top spot so when we play Milan, we only need to, to get a point to retain that. And we're through to the, the knockout stages anyway. Well ahead, well ahead in the league, rather. So that clash against Barcelona, although it is big, um, they're not even our really our closest rival, I, I don't think, at the moment. Still a, a brilliant game to play. Oh, Castro just losing out there. Managed to get it back. Here's Vieira. Now Castro. Modric. Castro again. Castro. Oh, powered in. And his run continues. It's a lovely play. Initially from Vieira. But Modric. A tight angle. So just had to go for power. And it worked. Nice little ball. Looked like I had maybe took it a bit too wide. The keeper's not going to stop that though. Castro is just such a... He's lethal in the box. Really is. And that's why when I brought him up as a regen, and his stats are still not anywhere near some of the other players we've got. Um, in previous games I've had him as a region I don't even know why I first got him because it's like I say that's aren't that impressive um, but he just plays so much better than his stats and I don't know how that works but he just does such a great finish of the of shots let's pull from Zirkov good tackle though Quickly played out. Ah, it's poor. Giobi gets it back though. Now Cousins, Castro, Mudrik. Castro in again. Defender just manages to keep ahead of him. Castro was bugging him. Defender stayed strong. That's a poor pass. Not at all where I was tending to play it either. Oh, it's Bushy got absolutely skinned there. Good defending in the end. I think that was Lovato. Had to clear it and he did. And again. Falling enough from my own players there. But Darby, Diaby comes away with it. Got a bit of a counter attack going on here. It's very quick. And here's Castro. Castro. Oh, just wide. Diaby did well in the end because he was running out of space. Managed to play the ball to Castro. And very difficult finish from, a, from an angle. But uh, as you can see, you sort of almost expect it from Castro. Modric into Castro again. Castro. Oh, fingertip save. Castro is all over this game at the moment. Not the best of corners there. And that's not the best of passes from Zirkov. No. Out for a goal kick. Not sure how it's only 1 0. It's 
The only downside I would say of this game is uh, we haven't got that second. Joey and Castro again. Madre Castro. Oh my word, he's hit it wide. Well, there's a collector's item for you. I think almost uh, I was just expecting it to see the back of the net. Russell, I didn't know what was going on when it didn't. Diaby, Castro. Oh, really nice play to Diaby. That's 2 0, and that's a classy goal. Again, Castro involved. Nice little 1 2. Wait till the last second to pass it and a calm finish. And Diaby's deserved that goal. Yeah, Castro drawing the players in, then passing off it at the last possible minute. Diaby smashing at home. And Diaby hasn't scored as many recently. It's all been about Castro and then obviously Martinelli in the last match. But he's always a threat. He's always a good player. It's so quick. And as you can see, he's a very good finisher as well. And you can't have every player being involved in every single game. You know, it's just not possible even if you score like in the last match where we scored six goals you just can't have every player involved in every goal so good tackle there Vieira just turns the wrong way I think Costanu with a good tackle Castro again now Vieira oh Castro was just about to play it through to Vieira and he was in there was space and a space here for the uh, opposition but win it back Zirkov. Oh, it's a terrible ball. Really poor. Had options. And it was probably the right option, but it's just a terribly executed pass. lavar has got some defending to do again. And he does. And stays calm too. It's more like it. Now Mudrick. Hasn't been as involved in the past sort of 10 15 minutes or so. Now Castro, Modric, Cousins. That's a terrible ball. Shouldn't have taken it first time. Modric. Now Castro, GRB. Nah, that's not a good ball either. Maybe just making some wrong decisions at the moment in some of the. Last couple of attacks. It's nearly half time. Happy with that 2-0 though. Assuming it stays that way. And it will. We'll jump back into the second half. Yeah, very dominant display in that first half. Should have been more than two. Um, but still very happy with the, the play that we had. Still can't believe that, that miss from Castro. It's not like him at all. So he is human. He is DRB. Fiera. Castro. No. <laughs> Definitely got the run of the luck there. They did. Fiera again. Castro. Oh, that's not a good pass, but DRB gets it back. Mudrick. DRB. Castro, oh, and he hits it wide again. What is going on? That's a couple today. Not like him at all. Well defended there. Diaby. Nice little touch to Mudrick. And he gets fouled, does he? Yeah, he does. Now, could this be a chance here? Cousins. Oh, the crossbar. Oh, so close to being perfect. Oh, great effort there. Okay, 
Kane Diaby gets it. Castro. Now Mudrick. Castro again. Diaby. Castro. <laughs> Diaby again. It's not much space. Now. Too many bodies. Ooh. Again. God, it's like a pinball machine here. Oh, that's a terrible tackle. And another chance of a free kick here. Oh, just over this time. That will make some subs now. So Zixi coming on for Ruben Castro, Lee Kang in coming on for Vieira and Carlos Perez coming for Diaby and Perez will get the uh, the captaincy armband when he comes on. Ideally I would have liked Castro to maybe get another goal or get involved in it, you know, get an assist or something, but he's done his job. He can't get a hat-trick in every game and uh, he should get a good rating and hopefully be fit for the next game too which is against Barcelona so massive match chance here and that's really poor goal given for Mandanda he's trying to close down the angle and didn't do so at all it's not great defending not at all um, brought him out and he's just covering the wrong part yeah just in off the post good finish but just made subs as well and then you're letting a goal and they don't deserve that. They haven't been involved in the game, really. We've had all the chances. He's leaking in. Sixy. Sixy. Very good effort. Did about as much as he could, really, Xerxy. Yeah, you, you know, you're never out of it. Just never know. Here's Debushi. Not the best of balls. We'll get it back. Here's Kusan. Sirksi. Mudrick. Oh, straight at the keeper. I'm not sure what happened there either. Lovato. Good tackle. Kusan's. Now Lee Kang in. Oh, that's got to be a penalty, has it? We're scored anyway. How did Carlos Perez get that in? got to see this again because Lee kang -in was running in and he got fouled. Oh, sorry, Perez got fouled. <laughs> and he slotted in anyway. What a strange goal. And I just realised I skipped the second replay, but probably didn't really need it. Well, we've got that two-goal advantage again. So a little bit of breathing room. Lee kang -in now to Xerxes. Perez, oh, I didn't get it through to Perez. Not a good pass. Good tackle by Herrera, though. A nice ball through to ZXC. Oh, and he does get onto it. And Mudrick with the tap in. And it's 4 1 now. Really nice ball, but look at this touch from Xerxes. Really stretched. And then calmly waits for Mudra to come in. It's a shame Herrera can't get like a... Almost like a second assist because that was such a good ball. And Mudra hasn't been too involved. He was a little bit involved towards the beginning of the game. Um, but like I say, a little bit quieter. But he's got that goal now. So that little blip... Hasn't really affected us. Oh, nice ball through to Xerxes. Now Mudrick. Xerxes again. I was trying to play a Cousins. Keep pressuring them. And we do get away with that. Yeah, 
yeah, I don't know why when you're three goals behind, why you'd be faffing around like this. Let's potentially pay for them. Xerxes oh, just can't quite get through. Oh, nice little ball there. Kang and Lee. Carlos Perez. Cousins. And Modric. Xerxes. <laughs> Great finish from him. Wonderful finish. It's really nice play. Cousins into Modric. But it's all about the finish there. Into the roof of the net. Of course, Mudrick will get an assist as well. He's just scored. Lovely left-footed finish. And that makes the game look a lot more comfortable and, and really what it should be. The amount of chances we uh, had in the first half. And Castro missing two that you would never expect to, to miss in one game as well. Oh, nice little flick. And Mudrick just didn't quite react. Should have been through on goal. Nice tackle from Herrera. Lee Kang in now. And Carlos Perez. Six C. Carlos Perez. Lee Kang in. Oh, that's wide. I'd love Lee Kang in to get more goals. It's not quite the same level as Vieira at this stage in terms of finishing. I think you'll get there eventually though. He's a very good player. Great work from Herrera again. Now Xerxes. Perez, he's through here. Could it be another? <laughs> it is. It's 6-1. What a substitute. What a standing captain as well. Xerxes, extremely good pass there. And it's all just about, you know, getting on target. Nice ball, lots of space. Touch inside, open up your body and just slot around the keeper. And that should be full time. And it is. 6 1 in the end. As you see, the, the only shot they had on goal was uh, the one they scored. Ruben Cash will get a man of the match. I would probably go with that, but as you can see, lots of sevens in there, sixes, some good all-round performances. Carlos Perez and Xerxes. I would argue maybe that they had more of an influence on the game, especially when it got a bit tight. But yeah, Castro was excellent as usual. And as you can see, we're now nine points ahead of Real Madrid and Barcelona. I think Real Madrid must have got another draw. Our next match being against Barcelona, we could really put some distance between ourselves. And then we've got that big match against AC Milan. We just need a draw in that one to get that top spot of the group stages. And we're through to the knockout stages anyway. And then we've got a match against Athletic Bilbao in the league as well. So thank you very much for joining once again. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're not ready, and drop a comment down below if you can. I'll see you all next time. Cheers.